Welcome to Happy Reading with Darby G. I'm going to show you some of my favorite activity books right now. These ones are ones I recommend for three years and up. A two-year-old would also enjoy some of these. And I, when I say an up, there is no limit to how old um, someone is that would enjoy this. You know your kid. But um, this rubber stamp activity is just like our fingerprint activities that we have that we still have um but this one uses stamps in different shapes and then that and then they you stamp the, the shape on there and then you can decorate them and embellish them with the other little features and stuff so it is a fun fun activity to do um with kids probably starting three and up and you'd have to supervise but this one is my favorite this is fun for adults i promise you <laughs> it is i think it might be the favorite activity that we have um, so what happens is, it's got a great instruction book. Um, it comes with these sticker cards. They um, There's an under the C one too. And there's 10 cards and each piece of these is a sticker that you then pull off and that leaves the adhesive out. Well then it comes with little pieces of foil where I haven't opened this package yet, but these are all foil in there. Um, different sheets like this and then you put it over the sticker and then you rub really really hard over it and then you take the foil off and it leaves behind the prettiness and then it has you do this through the whole thing and you fill it up and you can come up with some gorgeous um, pieces of art honestly like they're awesome and then this has an entire book of ideas of what you can do with those um, when you're finished. So it's 10 per package, and I hope we come up with more because I would, I love them. They're my favorite activity. But this is going to probably rival that. I just haven't gotten to use it because I just got it. This is a rub down transfer book. This is the Wild Garden. It comes with these sheets of decals, um, and they're, they come with a sheet behind it that protects it. So it doesn't, the stickies don't come off on just anything. And what you do is you find a page, that matches, so like you look at the stickers, um, the leaf color right there in that corner, and you find the leaf corner over there, and you go to the colored page, and you find wherever you wanna put something, and you rub it. And then you lift up, and that's where it leaves off, and you can decorate the whole thing that way. Um, you could do this side too if you want, but, or you could just color that, but this one has gotten rave reviews from kids and adults alike. Another one of our brand new ones is the Rainforest Mask. Um, <clears throat> excuse me, these are 3D masks. It comes with instructions, of course. Um, it comes with 10 masks um, that when you fold them, kind of origami style, and attach them, they end up being 3D on the face. But the cool thing too is it's a learning process because there's also an entire paragraph about that animal, and then it explains how to do it. So it comes with 10 masks. It's sure to be awesome for kids that have imagination and like to play. 365 science activities. This one is seriously great all the way up through elementary and junior high. Um, this has 365 activities that are um, all based on kind of usual things that you'll have in your house or easy to acquire items at least. Um, and there's so many projects within projects. And we've done a couple of them when he was just four and we've been totally fine. So some of them are a little bit older with the concepts, but you, you can gauge it best. And it lies flat, which I love the binding on that. Similar binding, um, probably same location you would do these in the kitchen. This is our cookbook. This is so popular. It goes in and out of stock. Um, so grab it while you can. But this has healthy, um, healthy recipes as well as desserts and sweets and treats. Rice and beans. Some of the stuff is really simple. And I have heard from, from some adults that it's helped their um, significant others who were not very great in the kitchen too. So um, pair that with an apron and you have an amazing birthday gift or Christmas gift. <clears throat> we have a lot of little um, seek and find type books. This is one that's a brand new one. It is similar to the Where's Will that we have that features William Shakespeare. This features all the different ballets that are well known. Um, there's a page that breaks it down by scene and um, does a synopsis of it. And then these are the people or characters that you have to find on the following spread. So it's a combination of literature with some fun finding, um, and it's sure to be fun for kids of all ages, even if they don't understand the ballet. 
And then we have these brand new wipe clean cards that we just got. There's an alphabet version and a numbers version. I'm not gonna open them because I'm one-handed and I'm really klutzy with one hand. But um, you can see that they will have a letter on there. They can practice the letter. They can practice the word. It is a great way. And there's different things you can do with them because they're like a flashcard, essentially. Um, there's some instructions in there of the ways to use it. So that is just a sampling of our activities. I hope you saw something you love. If you have any questions, just ask.